Aloha! Welcome to Lesson 8 of our Natural Clock Diapering class here on Easy Peasy. In this video, I'm going to explain all about clock diaper delivery services. What they are, how they work, and why you might want to choose one for clock diapering your baby. First of all, what is a clock diaper service? It's a service that delivers clean clock diapers right to your door and then after you've used them and they're dirty, they come pick them up and wash them for you. This is the easiest way to cloth diaper since you don't have to wash the diapers yourself. Someone else does that messy part for you. How does a cloth diaper service work? Each cloth diaper service is going to be a little bit different, but I'll explain the basics of how a cloth diaper service works. When you start your service, they'll drop off a diaper pail and one week's worth of clean cloth diapers. Normally the cloth diapers will be in a diaper liner, so this is either going to be like a plastic trash bag or a reusable cloth diaper pail liner. What you'll do is you'll take the clean cloth diapers out of that diaper liner, put them away wherever you're planning to store them, in baskets, a changing table, whatever works for you, and then you'll place that liner into the diaper pail which might just be a big plastic trash can with a lid that closes. It's gonna be big enough to store that whole week's worth of diapers. Then what you do is you use the diapers on your baby and once they've been peed on, you drop them into the lined diaper pail. If your baby is exclusively breastfed, you can put those poopy diapers right in too. However, if you have a baby who's eating solids, you'll want to plop the poop into the toilet before putting the diapers into the diaper pail. On your designated day and time, you'll put the full liner, just take the liner out of the pail, you'll place that outside your door or in the designated pickup place, and they'll come and take away those dirty diapers to wash them for you, and at the same time, drop off another full week's worth of clean cloth diapers. So you'll always have a constant supply of cloth diapers without having to wait around for any washing or drying time. If you're planning to cloth diaper your baby right from birth, you're usually expected to sign up for the service about three weeks before your baby's born. And they usually give you a leeway of they may drop off the diapers about three weeks before your expected guest date, but then not start charging you for the service until your baby arrives and you actually start using them. But you'll want to keep in contact with the service to let them know when your baby's there and you have started using them so that one week from that point, they can come to pick up the dirty ones. Why might a cloth diaper service be the right choice for your family? First of all, is if you're just too busy to have time to wash and dry cloth diapers. Perhaps you're working at home or in the office and you're just too busy for washing them, then a cloth diaper service can be great because you still get all the benefits of cloth diapering, the environmental benefits, the benefits for your baby, but you don't have to do the step of washing. Another time when a cloth diaper service is a great choice is if you don't have your own personal washer and dryer at home. For example, when our first baby was born, we were living in a high rise apartment building in Waikiki and there was shared laundry facilities on a different floor of the building that were coin operated. So it was easier for us at that time to have cloth diapers delivered instead of me constantly going up and down the elevator to go wash cloth diapers and have to pay to wash and dry those in the laundry facilities. With my second baby, I wanted more options than what our local cloth diaper delivery service offered. So I did end up purchasing cloth diapers for her and washing them myself. And I was spending about $50 a month just on the washing and drying of those diapers. Plus I had invested in the diapers themselves. So you can go ahead and do the math and in that kind of situation, it may actually be financially better to do the diaper service. I highly recommend considering a cloth diaper service for the newborn phase. So anywhere from the first one, two or three months of your baby's life, you could go ahead and ask for gift certificates for your local cloth diaper service on your baby shower registry. And that would be a much appreciated gift to not be having to wash cloth diapers during the newborn phase. Parents with a newborn baby at home are often exhausted, waking up multiple times at night or feeding, changing the baby, just not getting a whole lot of sleep. So not having to wash cloth diapers is one thing off your plate 
to help you get more time to bond with your baby and a little bit more time to rest. I remember when my daughter was a newborn, the one thing I put in during the day was washing her cloth diapers. But if I didn't have to do that, I could have got other little projects done or maybe taken a nap with her. By hiring a cloth diaper service for those early days, you can skip investing in the newborn cloth diapers and just put your money towards the sizes that your baby will be able to wear for longer. How many cloth diapers will the service provide? Again, this will vary a bit from service to service, but generally it's somewhere in the range from about 70 to 90 cloth diapers to get you through the week. Normally the smaller sizes, you'll be getting more of them, and as your baby gets up to the bigger sizes, not as many cloth diapers. However, with most services, you can contact them and ask to increase the amount. The 70 to 90 comes out to about 10 to 12 diaper changes per day. For me, since I practice elimination communication and change my baby's diaper quite frequently, during the newborn phase, my babies were going through about 20 cloth diapers per day, which comes out to around 140 cloth diapers per week. Luckily with our local diaper service, Dolphin Diaper Service here on Oahu, they only charge a little bit more for each increment of additional diapers that you want to request. If you get to the end of the week, it's your pick up and drop off day for the diapers and you still have more clean ones, you just go ahead and keep those at home and the diaper service will account for that and how many they bring you next time. A lot of diaper services assign the diapers for a particular family, so they'll have twice as many diapers as you get per week assigned to your family. So if you normally get 90 per week, they'll have 180 cloth diapers assigned to your family. So if you have those leftover extra ones, you keep those clean ones, just send back the dirty ones, and they keep track of how many come back and forth to your family. Which styles of cloth diapers do diaper delivery services offer? This is where the diaper services vary the most from one to another. The most commonly offered style of cloth diaper are pre-folds. So these are these rectangular ones where there's more layers down in the middle and fewer on the side. If you're new to cloth diapering and you're not familiar with all the different styles, you can refer back to lesson three, where I explained the various types of natural cloth diapers and how to put each one on your baby. For this one, you could tri-fold and put it in a cover, or you could use a snappy and secure it on around your baby. But pre-folds will be offered by almost all cloth diaper services. When I was researching cloth diaper services, I was so happy to see that there are some modern services that offer quite an array of styles of cloth diapers. So some of them, in addition to offering the pre-folds, also offer fitted diapers. There are ones that offer all-in-one diapers, pocket diapers, and you could even get a combination pack from some where you get some cloth diapers and some disposable diapers if that's what works best for your family. Many cloth diaper services also offer cloth training pants. So when your child's in the potty learning journey, making that transition to potty trained, you might wanna opt for cloth training pants as a transitional step from the diapers to being diaper free. Some cloth diaper services only provide and wash the inner portion of the cloth diaper that absorbs, and then it will be up to you to purchase and wash on your own, the outer waterproof covers. So this varies from service to service. There are some services where you can add in covers as part of the service, cloth wipes, inserts. Again, you wanna check with your local service what exactly the options are. With a cloth diaper service, you are just renting or borrowing the cloth diapers. They belong to the service. So when you cancel your subscription, you'll return all the cloth diapers, and also if you were borrowing the diaper pail, you'll return that as well. Some services also have the option where you can rent a bundle of cloth diapers that you wash at home. So perhaps if you don't wanna be stuck with the cloth diapers after your baby's outgrown that size, you don't wanna to have to deal with trying to resell them or you're not expecting to have another baby, you might want to do that where you rent the bundle, wash it at home, and give it back when you're done with it. That will be a bit less expensive than having the diaper service wash the diapers for you. There are also some diaper services that have designed their own cloth diapers and they may offer those for purchase. So I have here two examples to share with you. 
First is Lulu Do. They're a cloth diaper service located in Southern California. They service Los Angeles, Orange County, San Diego, Ventura, and Santa Barbara County. So if you're somewhere in that area, I used to live down there. Lulu Do cloth diaper service is a great option to look into. Lulu Do offers one of the biggest selection of styles or types of cloth diapers. So they have pre-folds. These are two examples of fitted diapers that I purchased from Lulu Do. They also have newborn covers. They have their own convertible cover that can be used either as just a cover over a fitted or pre-fold, or you can snap in a liner and it becomes a pocket diaper. Lulu Do also offers all-in-one cloth diapers and they have different packages. So if you want, you could opt for a package that's like part all-in-one cloth diapers, part disposable diapers, or what I would choose is a package that's part fitted diapers and part pre-folds. And then they also have where you can add on covers if you want or add in wipes as well. This is a size one Lulu Do fitted diaper that it's intended to fit from newborn up to 14 pounds. There's one set of rise snaps here so that if you have a newborn baby and you want to cloth diaper from birth, then supposedly if you have it on this setting, it will sit under the umbilical cord. These are super soft. They're pretty thick as well. I believe they have six layers of cotton velour in there. There's no separate tongue, so if you're washing these at home, then they probably would take quite a while to dry. But if you're getting them through the service, that doesn't really matter because the service would be washing and drying them for you. This is a size two Lulu Do fitted diaper, which is intended to fit from 12 to 22 pounds. It's also out of the super soft cotton velour. That's one of my favorites. One set of snaps to adjust the rise. And then of course you can choose the waist setting. I like that these wings only each have one snap. To me, that's easier to just have to snap at once than on some fitted diapers, they'll have like two or three snaps per wing. And again, all the absorbency is sewn in. Another diaper service that I'd like to mention is Diaper Kind that services New York City. They offer either pre-folds or fitted diapers, and they give you the option that if you want, you can purchase a set of either polyester diaper covers or wool diaper covers through their website. They offer the Baby Greens wool diaper covers, which I do highly recommend. After running Diaper Kind for about 10 years, the founders designed their own line of cloth diapers for those who want to purchase and wash cloth diapers at home. So their system, they made it super simple for people to use. It comes with an inner, which is also known as a fitted diaper, and an outer, which is a waterproof polyester cover. One thing that I really like about Assembly is both their polyester covers and their wet bags are made from recycled polyester. So old water bottles have been turned into fabric and then that polyester fabric is used to sew these bags and the diaper covers. They are lined with a waterproof laminate layer inside. And this cute little day bag, they designed it so that you could put clean cloth diapers, your keys, your wallet in this outer pocket, just throw it on your shoulder and then when you're out and about, the baby has a dirty diaper, move it to the bigger pocket. So it's kind of like both a wet bag and a little day bag purse in one. If you watched lesson six on washing cotton cloth diapers, I also mentioned their assembly baby washing powder. This has been designed specifically for washing cloth diapers. So if you're looking for a diaper safe laundry detergent, assembly baby washing powder is a great option. The Assembly Baby fitted diapers are made out of a woven fabric. It appears to be a twill, kind of diagonal lines on it, and it's super trim. For instance, this one looks way thinner than the Lulu Do Velour diaper. One feature that I really like on the Assembly inners and outers is that they've marked which one is the center snap with a different color. So there's blue in the center here. So when you're putting this on your baby, you're not having to go like one, two, three, four, and figure out where you're at when you're snapping. You just know that these are the center snaps. Inside it has like this soaker pad, this sort of a butterfly style to make for easier washing and drying. And this system is supposed to be really good containment by having a fitted diaper with elastic around the legs, 
and on the back and then also having the cover you should have all the poop stay inside the cloth diaper i also like that on the covers there's a little bit of elastic both on the front and the back i heard from somebody else's video that that allows you to kind of pull the cover up onto a squirmy baby which could be a great option once your baby's mobile again they have the center snaps marked here and then two snaps i do like on the cover where it has these two snaps so that you can adjust the waist and adjust the leg to get a really good fit for your baby. These particular ones I have here are size one, which is intended to fit seven to 17 pounds. And then they have size two as well. That wraps up lesson eight on cloth diaper delivery services. I hope I answered your questions. If you still have any more, please leave them in the comments below. Up next in lesson nine, I will show you how to sew your own cotton cloth diapers. I will show you how to make a do-it-yourself black cloth diaper, which doesn't require any sewing at all, how to make an insert or a doubler, how to sew your own cloth prefolds, and also how to sew your own fitted diaper. Please subscribe and turn on notifications. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Let's make cloth mainstream.